Hi everyone, welcome to LiveX's Rivet how-to series where we'll be showing you how to use our SRT remote contribution tool. Today we'll be taking a look at the High Vision Makito encoder and the High Vision Makito decoder. Let's take a look. First off, let's log into our Makito encoder on the web interface. In the outputs, let's create a new stream. This will be our return feed so our caller can hear and see our picture. We'll be toggling video and audio encoder number four today broadcasting over SRT, of course. This will be for our listener with a unique port number of 5553, which we'll need for Rivet later on. After applying the settings, let's head over to our video encoder settings. Here we'll select the correct input that we manually patched. We'll change our algorithm to AVC H264. We'll change our bit rate to 2500 and let's go ahead and set our resolution to automatic and let's go ahead and toggle our audio. Again, let's select the proper input that we manually patched and let's change our algorithm to MPG2ADTS. Now let's move on to our decoder. Same thing, log into the web interface. On your home page, create a new stream. Just going to call this Rivet. Transmit over SRT. This will be for our listener with another custom port number. I'll be choosing 5050. Let's change the latency to match at 250. Hit apply. And now let's go ahead and configure these two so they can work together. Select the stream you created, Rivet Makito. Check all your settings. Hit apply. Now let's head over to Rivet. Log in with your account. After you create a stream, you have the option of copying the URL with all the port and IP settings and send it to your caller, or you can go in and create a stream. You'll need your public IP address and the listener and caller port numbers we created on the Makito encoder and decoders. The resolution and audio settings and your bitrate and latency should all match the information you input onto your decoder. To further protect your stream, you're able to add a encryption key. Now once you've created your stream on Rivet with all of the proper settings, go ahead and hit launch and you'll be well on your way with your SRT production. If you have any questions, feel free to leave us a comment and thank you again for watching. Stay tuned for our next Rivet how-to video.